2024 Honda Odyssey First Test Navigating Size with Poise What makes this van mini? While Honda directs more attention to the Pilot SUV, the 2024 Odyssey stands as a practical three-row family vehicle. Its substantial size distinguishes it, providing ample space for passengers and versatility that defines the driving experience. As we explore this pragmatic people carrier, let's see how it competes in today's dynamic three-row vehicle market. Pros. Immensely practical and versatile. Slick shifting 10 speed. Comfortable and quiet cabin. Cons. Feels huge and cumbersome. Unimpressive digital displays. Yesteryear fuel economy. Consistency is a key characteristic of this generation of the Odyssey. Introduced in 2018, it underwent a mid-cycle refresh in 2021, and for 2024, it remains unchanged. Honda has hinted at potential changes, even a full redesign, for the 2025 model year. The Odyssey is powered by a 3.5-liter V6 engine generating 280 horsepower and 262 lbft of torque. This power is transmitted to the front wheels through a 10-speed automatic transmission. Notably, all-wheel drive is not an option, unlike some competitors like the Chrysler Pacifica and Toyota Sienna. During testing, the 2024 Odyssey exhibited performance metrics consistent with its predecessors. Accelerating from 0 to 60 miles per hour took 6.8 seconds, with the V6 roaring through the quarter mile in 15.2 seconds at 94.5 miles per hour. In everyday driving, the Odyssey is leisurely off the line, yet the engine, with its eagerness to rev, propels the van smoothly to highway speeds. The 10-speed transmission, with closely spaced ratios, maintains the engine in its optimal range, delivering quick and nearly imperceptible gear changes. Notably, the transmission responds promptly to inputs from the paddle shifters. In 2021, the Odyssey received an electric brake booster, contributing to a pedal feel that is both soft and progressive, enhancing smooth stops. While this hardware doesn't improve the van's 60 to 0 miles per hour braking performance, it enables the implementation of full-speed adaptive cruise control, capable of bringing the vehicle to a complete stop, something not possible at lower speeds before. This feature is part of the standard Honda Sensing Suite, which equips the Odyssey lineup with practical and effective driver assist features. Honda often touts the Odyssey as fun, but it lacks excitement on a broader scale, at least when compared to vehicles beyond the realm of minivans. It moves with unhurried precision, and while the steering is slow, it maintains a sufficient connection to confidently follow the desired path. The poised suspension tuning ensures a smooth ride while keeping the vehicle in stable control. However, the Odyssey's driving experience lacks the thrill, as indicated by its figure-eight result of 29.3 seconds at a 0.56G average and a skip-pad grip of 0.76G both figures suggesting a preference for a more leisurely pace. Despite its substantial size, longer than the Pilot, equally wide, and nearly as tall, the Odyssey's driving dynamics highlight the challenge of maneuvering through common corners and parking spaces. While it may be mild-mannered, navigating it demands attention due to its size. Surprisingly, it's only about 5 inches shorter than the Ford Expedition, a full-size three-row SUV. Nevertheless, the Odyssey's size translates into significant interior capacity, nearly 145 cubic feet, surpassing even the pilot. Every inch is designed for family use, with the second-row seats offering versatile positioning options and the easy-fold third row adding to the flexibility. Rear doors that open and shut with a single touch and numerous storage cubbies enhance practicality. The Odyssey's lower floor compared to most SUVs simplifies access to rear seats and increases cargo capacity. While Honda has directed more attention to the Pilot, leaving the Odyssey largely unchanged, it has resulted in the minivan's tech features appearing somewhat outdated. Despite being functional, the size of the infotainment and gauge cluster displays fall short of impressive. In an era focused on electrification, the Odyssey's fuel economy of 1928 MPG city-slash-highway seems excessive, particularly when compared to more fuel-efficient hybrid rivals. Looking ahead to the 2025 model, there's an expectation for the Odyssey to receive modern tech and a more efficient powertrain. Given its shared platform with the Pilot, the new Pilot's cabin tech offers a preview of what the new Odyssey might feature. Nonetheless, even with the impending release, the 2024 Odyssey's well-sorted driving manners and extensive versatility are unlikely to lose their appeal. 2024 Honda Odyssey – Pros and Cons 
The 2024 Honda Odyssey is a minivan that aims to make family life easier and more enjoyable. It's spacious, versatile, and packed with features. But like any vehicle, it has its pros and cons. Here's a rundown to help you decide if it's the right minivan for you. Pros Spacious and versatile interior. The Odyssey offers ample space for passengers and cargo. The second row magic seats fold flat into the floor, and the third row seats can be easily removed, providing up to 155 cubic feet of cargo space. Smooth and powerful engine. The 3.5-liter V6 engine provides 280 horsepower and 262 lbft of torque, making it easy to accelerate and merge onto highways. The 10-speed automatic transmission shifts smoothly and helps keep the engine RPMs low for better fuel economy. Comfortable and quiet ride. The Odyssey has a comfortable suspension that absorbs bumps and ruts well. The cabin is also well insulated, making for a quiet and relaxing ride. Standard Honda Sensing Safety Features Every Odyssey comes equipped with Honda Sensing, a suite of driver assistance features that includes automatic emergency braking, lane departure warning, and adaptive cruise control. Family-friendly features The Odyssey has a variety of features that make it great for families, such as a built-in vacuum cleaner, a rear entertainment system, and a cabin intercom system. Cons Fuel Economy The Odyssey's fuel economy is not as good as some other minivans, especially those with hybrid powertrains. It gets an EPA-estimated 22 miles per gallon in the city and 28 miles per gallon on the highway. Large size, the Odyssey is a large minivan, which can make it difficult to maneuver in tight spaces. Unimpressive infotainment system, the infotainment system is not as user-friendly as some other systems on the market. The graphics are dated, and the menus can be confusing. Magic seats can be heavy, the magic seats are convenient, but they can be heavy and difficult to remove. Overall, the 2024 Honda Odyssey is a great choice for families looking for a spacious, versatile, and comfortable minivan. However, it's important to consider its fuel economy and size before making a decision. Here are some additional things to consider. Budget The Odyssey is one of the more expensive minivans on the market. Features Decide which features are most important to you and make sure the Odyssey has them. Competitors, consider other minivans, such as the Toyota Sienna and Chrysler Pacifica, before making a decision. I hope this information helps you decide if the 2024 Honda Odyssey is the right minivan for you. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos like this.